All right, well, let's take a look at one of the big movers of the morning, and that is Moderna shares climbing to the upside up just about 6% after posting a surprise profit in the fourth quarter, despite seeing a 43% slump in COVID-19 vaccine sales. Yahoo Finance's Anjali Kemlani spoke with Moderna's CEO about those results a minutes ago. Anjali, what did you hear? That's right, Shauna. Moderna surprisingly coming out with the beat this time, despite the fact that we've seen the waning COVID vaccine story play out for it and other companies. But the company is saying that they do see the market for this. They, in fact, did increase their market share uh, for COVID vaccines in the last quarter. So really a strong story there. And it has been a year of transition. And that's really the, the sort of takeaway that CEO uh, Stefan Bensel told me earlier today. Listen to what he had to say. Last year was a transition year, as we said all along last year. We right sized manufacturing, took a big write off, mostly non cash uh, uh, in the fall. And now, a big rally off to the races. You know, we have been gaining share in the US, and our objective this year in 2024 is to increase vaccination rate. So as you can see, that write-off, of course, with $2.2 billion, right-sizing manufacturing, and then focusing on the RSV vaccine launch, what they expect to happen this year, could add to the revenues for the company. In addition, they're working on their combo flu and COVID vaccine. And they also have that partnership, of course, with Merck for the cancer vaccine. And all told, looking for a strong future. But it is interesting also to see where Moderna is playing in the market with a focus on vaccines and infectious diseases diseases, also at a time where oncology is big, as well as AI, Moderna being one of the first companies to really use AWS to be able to identify the current COVID-19 vaccine. I asked uh, Stefan whether or not that is a, a sort of an example of how far along the technology is or whether or not AI still has a little bit of a drawback. And here's what he had to say. If you look at large set of data, to look at patterns on very large set of data. This is where machine learning today is actually very adapted. And that's the type of use we are doing. We're not using to report financials. This is still done by standard systems uh, like SAP and, and, and standard technology. But when you're dealing with very large set of data, the ability of machine learning system to look at patterns and to see things that a human cannot see because they're just so much data, that part of the technology we believe is ready so as you can hear, definitely some future in there and whether or not the company continues to grow beyond that, what it has in its pipeline is what investors are waiting to see, but still a strong result and still bullish on the potential COVID market is where Moderna currently stands. All right, Anj, thanks so much. We will be talking with an analyst uh, from Oppenheimer with an outperform rating on the stock here later this hour. Get his thoughts on this report. All right, Anj, thanks so much.